the cuticles of your hair are the windows into the deeper structure of the cortex, holding moisture where it's needed and protecting your hair from the environment. When the cuticles are damaged, the hair loses moisture easily and will suffer more readily in situations of low or high humidity. In this state, the hair is said to be porous. Porous hair can occur naturally in some people, but for the most part it is a result of damage to the cuticles. If your hair is porous, the best indication is that it absorbs hair dye really well, yet fades unexpectedly fast. This is because the color can be washed out of your hair easier than if the cuticles were intact to prevent it from leaving the hair shaft. Cuticle damage can also cause the hair to feel dry and rough, and it will be more prone to split ends and frizz. The cuticles can't be replaced, but the symptoms can be controlled relatively easily. To combat dryness, always condition your hair after you've shampooed it, and follow this up with a dab of leave-in conditioner for more stubborn dryness. Adequate conditioning is all that's required to cut down a lot of the frizz and prevent brittleness that can lead to snapping. Protecting your hair from the environment is also a simple matter, and can be accomplished with the use of smoothing serums. A good smoothing serum will coat the hair shaft, trapping moisture and locking it in where it's required. When a smoothing serum has been applied, the hair shaft is coated with a silicone barrier and the humidity isn't able to drastically affect your hair. It functions a little like an artificial cuticle to keep the hair looking and feeling its best. Finally, when you dye hair that has suffered cuticle damage, the porosity often leads to uneven results. To prevent this, always treat your hair with a porosity equalizing product before you apply any dye. Subscribe us to No More Hair Growth Treatments and Tips.